the level of intimidation where the Entoche's family they give me is too much. Some of them are not going to understand. <laughs> but we, when they inside, of course we do. We understand the intimidation is too much. The intimidation, eh, not be here. They don't do everything by their power to make sure say they lock this woman inside bottle. They make sure say they pin her down so that she cannot have a voice. My people, the matter why they talk now, it not happened today. Oh. No. It's not what today. They have started doing it for a very long time. Some of them of you understand. But before we go, make a fair greet my amazing people. On a good morning, afternoon, and evening, depend the place and the time we will take come across my video or wait for the watch me right now. I greet as a lot of them according to our time. If you never subscribe on my YouTube channel, please do. Hit the button when you say subscribe. If you didn't follow me for Facebook page, press the button when you say follow. Put on your notification bell always. So anytime when I put any program, you go there among the very first person when you go see him. At the back, when I make when I follow me, they share my video. Make when I still they like my video. And please, at the end of the video, always leave your comments for the comment station. My people, there's what they call intimidation. And another thing they will call emotional blackmail. <laughs> it they. And if they use them on you, you go to feel bad. You go to feel guilty. But you are not the cause of the problem. Now the person, when they give you that emotional blackmail, now that person be the cause of the problem. But because the person is trickish, the person will not make you feel bad. And after some time, if they don't they do it to you, you'll be actually feeling bad for yourself, thinking that it's your fault, whereas it's not your fault. That is exactly what you and Doche did to me and Doche. When a man leave you for another woman, and he put it in a way that is your fault, you'll be blaming yourself and asking yourself too much question. What did I do? Where did I go wrong? Am I not good enough for him? So what did I go wrong? You you start thinking, cracking your head and your brain for nothing, no. For what? For nothing. It's not your fault. I want women today to stop blaming yourself for what you don't know anything about. It's not you. It's him. But because he's that kind of person. That doesn't accept mistakes. Is that kind of person that don't want people to blame him? So what is he trying to do now? He's trying to push the blame on you, and he has been doing it for a very long time. You did not understand. It's not you. It's not your fault. You didn't do anything. It's him. It's his fault. He caused it. He's the one that is doing it. He got nothing to do with you. So stop blaming yourself because it's not you, it's them. It's them. That is exactly the Duchess is doing to you. To me, sorry. Oh, me is selfish. We have been begging you for one year. You refuse, you refuse to accept. I've called for a family meeting. You refuse to come. So they are kind of blaming me. They are kind of pushing everything to me. That means they are forcing me to accept what she does not believe on. Because me said, I cannot be forced or casual into polygamy. Or I cannot be numbered to be a wife. But what are they doing right now? That thing she forbid is. That thing she says she doesn't want. That's what they are pushing and burning her hand for her to accept. They send a letter to online in laws, telling online in laws through center matches for online in laws to mind their business. I'll tell you why they send center matches to say that. Because they know online in laws is supporting me. 
or that in-laws, they are the one that is standing by me. They are the one that is encouraging me. That's why you see that. They are sending letters to online in-laws saying, online in-laws should mind their business. Online in-laws should use Because they don't want anybody to support me. They want to be top. They want me to be done. And Mel is a very tough person. She's very smart. She knows what they are trying to do. But sometimes she can break down. Because it's too much for her to handle. All this thing is too much for one person. She can't take it anymore. She can't stand it anymore. She's crying for herself. She's blaming herself. She's regretting so many things. Why did I come to this family? Why did I stay here? Why did I not see it coming? Why did I have to take my son? She's thinking so many things. But guys, you know what? It's not main fault too. It's their fault. It's them. But they're trying to put everything in mail. But to their own greatest surprise, to their own greatest shame, the place where God come past them, might be this. Everything they thought belonged to them. Everything with their things saying are their own. They later come find out that it's not their own. That actually is for me. And since all these years, may not talk anything. She not say anything for one day. She keep quiet. Watching them. Looking at them patiently. For our own money, our own property. They were insulting her. They, they were doing so many things to make her angry, to get her angry, but she did not. She kept quiet. She they look them, they laugh. So God. Is that why our woman be is? Yes, yeah, so now so woman be now so they be. Oh. In case if you don't know. That is the way they are. Now what thing that they do be that? Then they will be using you and they will be making you to feel bad for yourself. Don't. If your husband cheat on you, it's not your fault. If your husband went to go and carry on that woman, it's not your fault, especially when you know you have done your best to make the marriage work. So I'm sending this message to me strongly. May don't feel bad, it's not your fault. It's you and Judy Austin's fault. It's Judy Austin, the woman that cannot stay her own husband's house. It's Judy Austin, the woman that cannot save her own home. But she's here to destroy somebody else's marriage. It's her. It's not you. You got nothing to do with this. It's not your fault at all. It's your fault. It's them. Not you, my dear. So I want you to know that. So my people, they say, what thing we go do this woman? We go pay her more since she refused to accept Judy Austin. She refused to bring Judy Austin in. She refused to let Judy Austin come into the house. What do we do to her? You know what they did to her? They took away her joy. They took away what she loved most in her life. What it be that? Her song. Say, if you come out this boy that he loves so much, this is so with they proud. This is so with they catch him for body. This is so when they make her look like, oh, now she be the top, I have a son. This is the son she lay her shoulder on. This is the son that she called my husband. This is the son that is telling the mama, mama, you know me. I am going to be a great person in life. You know. My future is huge. I have a, I have a dream. According to what they talk, they say this boy things are perfect. You never see blame on him. He wants to make everybody happy. He's always making his mom happy. He's always calling his mom, you are my wife, I will take off you. The mama will say, yes, I know. Now you be my husband now. Anytime the mama see the son growing 
he go they laugh because he they see you on that boy. And you they also find out that all the documents they have, all the property that you and me have, is Kambili, Kambili, Kambili. And I said, okay. Because you, you don't, your maid don't want to accept me. I will teach me a lesson that she will never forget in our in her life, in a hurry. What did she do? She took away the thing that may love so much in her life, thinking that she's going to bring me down. But she's only bringing herself down. Yes, she's bringing herself down, not me. Because she's going to pay dearly all of them that gang up against that innocent woman and her children. They will pay. They will pay dearly. My people, men is winning. Congratulations to her. She has stand up. She don't bath. She don't get up. She saw everything is mine. My son is there watching over me. They cannot do her anything anymore. Don't worry. There is God. It will take time, but God did. Everybody, anything anybody do for Israel, they must sweep it before they go. They have done their worst to me. Let's be honest here. But I will leave you guys. I will soon have my next video. Leave your comment for the comment station. Thank you and God bless you all.